C88. Hello everyone and welcome back to Svixamore. My name is Soros88 and today, as you can see, we are uh, rocking a new outfit <laughs> and it has its reasons. Um, I went to my uh, dress room in, in Minecraft and I selected a, a few fits that were called uh, like um, archaeology, uh, yeah, the, the archaeology jacket and the archaeology uh, pants and stuff. And also these uh, kind of wonky little glasses on my face. I think they look nice. <laughs> and I think they are fit for what I am planning for us to do today. Uh, also, as you can see, I'm now using again the Quadral um, texture pack. Since they already uh, updated it to the new version of Minecraft 1.20. And yeah, I mean, I'm not such a fan of how the cherry blossoms look in this one. I think it's too green for my taste. Uh, but yeah, uh, the wood um, textures on the other hand looks amazing, I think. Um, as you can see, like uh, the planks looks beautiful and the stripped wood looks amazing. I think it's the most beautiful one out of the, out of, uh, out of the new blocks. Also, uh, the, the trap doors and the doors look quite nice as well and uh, if you remember last episode I actually uh, was in depth <laughs> with you I told you I was going to be working on the basement of the of the base and so I did uh, but I haven't showed you that so let's just jump right back here and ta-da I think it looks quite nice as you can see, I went down quite a few blocks, like three or four blocks more. And yeah, I placed a floor, stone floor in this case. And here I like made the staircase, which divided uh, this part of the basement like in two halves. And so this half is for uh, potion brewing. I have an infinite water source here. And then I have here the potion stands. And here will be where I... Um, stock all my my ingredients and stuff here's some decoration with uh, you know like cutting knives and stuff for preparation uh, I think it looks nice and over here I have like all of the other um, working stations that we usually need for this and uh, yeah uh, all of this is just storage I already started like crumpling in stuff but I still have to like uh, label all of this for <laughs> for me to be able to find stuff here because yeah it's kind of confusing at times and of course here we have like our enchanting uh, space with uh, th uh, 30 level um, enchanting table uh, some some places for us to also gather some lapis lazuli and some books enchanted books as well and of course some mobs mob heads for decoration uh, since we already have so many <laughs> and we have a, a direct access from the basement to our house so yeah i think it's kind of cozy kind of well distributed and with the basic stuff that we need for us to start exploring and building uh, on this part of the map and that's exactly what we are going to be doing today uh, that's why my outfit is uh, for exploration <laughs> Um, we are going to be exploring the mine shaft that we found a few episodes back, right over there. So let me place my armor on because yeah, we're going to be on the road. And yeah, basically that's what this episode is going to be about. <laughs> uh, we are just going to try and find some interesting loot, some interesting stuff. Hopefully I will like to see if we can find some uh, spawners. Because I think if I remember well, I saw uh, one spider spawner, which, I mean, spider spawns, um, it's not that useful, but maybe with exploration we will find, hopefully, hopefully, a skeleton one, but also a zombie one would be appreciated. Um, so yeah, basically I'm, I'm, I'm trying to find uh, whatever I can. So I don't know where to start here. <laughs> Because it's such a huge cave system, and the 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 mine shaft is also quite big. I'm not actually sure how far it goes, neither down or sideways. 
So yeah, I was thinking maybe building a, a little bit of a uh, a base down here, like not a full-fledged base, but just like with a bed and stuff. So if in case we get killed, uh, we can go right back to to the mine shaft. So maybe just starting with uh, lighting a little bit this cave because it's too dark and yeah we're going to uh, be dead sooner than later <laughs> uh, yeah I guess let's not go this way for now because then I will go in a whole different direction from exploration that I want yeah a ton of moths already spawning <laughs> I guess it's hunting time. I enchanted this bow because my my really powerful bow was destroyed when when I fell into the lava on the Nether. I think I already told you that story. <laughs> I died like maybe 12, 30 times. Oh, he's right behind me. And yeah, I, I just uh, improvised this one which has unbreaking 3 and power 2 just to pack a little bit more of a punch. But yeah, I'm currently bowless. <laughs> so yeah, I guess this one as well, we'll we'll go back another time. Already creepers here, and I'm guessing this is a good spot for us to begin. So yeah, for example, here we have like a poison spider, I think, because they are smaller. And those I don't know if I want. Should be should be good for a farm, but I'm not quite fond of those farms since they are actually quite dangerous. <laughs> a lot of water. Oh, there's a there's a there's this thing here. I don't see anything. Whoa, this fog effect is... Ooh. Eh, not so much of a great loot, but something something. Okay, I'll take it. Maybe I'll equip my <laughs> sword instead. Yeah, I don't see like anything else of interest like right away. Oh, there's another spawner back here, down here. Ooh, we could do a double spawner here. Okay, that's nice. That's actually nice. Let's see if we can uh, beat the the spawn time in, in this one. I don't know if they actually keep spawning with light. Hopefully not. Oh, yep, they keep spawning. Damn, that's going to be a problem. noises man <laughs> okay okay well I think uh, the best thing I can do here it's actually just make a little bit of a montage since we're going to be exploring like a lot this is going to be a huge montage and maybe I will just drop in for some <laughs> commentary here and there but but yeah I think this is going to be like better presented to you because I'm going to spend quite a long time here 
and yeah i don't want to bore you like doing this uh <laughs> stuff so yeah uh, let's let's just jump right into it and i'll see you in a moment Alright, so I guess that's it. <laughs> I finished uh, exploring all of the holes here. <laughs> well, if you can call it holes. Uh, but yeah, all the bridges and snook and crannies. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, it, it's it's not that big <laughs> as I thought it was going to be. That's what she said. Uh, <laughs> but, but yeah, um it's mostly on the outside here so once the the passages go inside the rock they don't go too far uh, so yeah it was a little bit disappointed disappointing not gonna lie I thought we were going to find uh, a lot more stuff and a lot more interesting things but on the bright side I did manage to gather a lot of resources which are never uh, underappreciated so um, ah, oh and the other thing uh, it's that we found two um, spawners I'm a little bit lost I don't know where to go <laughs> uh, you know what let me just fly out because it's also night time so yeah it's going to be dangerous a little bit but yeah so here we we will have a little bit more of a view maybe you saw this view on the um, montage but yeah uh, where's our oh yeah there, there we go there we go now I found myself so as you saw in the montage I made this kind of a little base uh, it's reminiscent of episode 4 I think where I told you guys that I was trying uh, I was gonna try uh, to do this type of small bases uh, from time to time when we were exploring caves and stuff just so I uh, didn't have the need to go back to our main base and stuff so yeah this is kind of like uh, the continuation of that it's a little bit, a little bit empty for, uh, for now but yeah I will still uh, furnish it and just decorate it a little bit uh, but then I realized now that we are uh, able to fly <laughs> I think it's going to be just like more of a decorational stuff and more for the world building part of, of this series uh, because yeah I, I don't think I'm actually going to be using this like quite as I intended first <laughs> so yeah that's that's one thing uh, so we got this one spawner here and we also have another one down here so we could make the double spider spawner which I think would uh, 
give us uh, great rates. So yeah, I mean, I don't know if it will be any use for the materials the spiders drop, but maybe for the experience we could do so. But I also want to work on on an ender, um, an ender enderman killing chamber on the end um, because yeah, that's that's going to be a little bit more effective. Uh, so yeah, the last thing I wanted to do before we close up this episode was kind of go further down these caves because as you can see there's kind of uh, a mid level which is where where this whole structure is like based on and as you can see I've also kind of lit it up uh, all of these caves I did kind of explore uh, some of the nearby caves ca ca caves caves I did kind of explore some of the nearby caves but yeah I didn't went like full on them uh, and yeah, I realized that there's this like huge cave underneath <laughs> that I wanted to like just check out very quickly. Maybe just do a flyby to see if there's anything of interest down there. Because remember, we are also on the look for um, the last um, update uh, new caves. I, I want to find a warden. And, and the ancient cities and stuff. Oh, this looks so cinematic. Maybe I will just uh, punch a little bit of the lightning on the editing, editing room because, yeah, on my monitor, I think it looks good, but I'm not so sure how it's going to look on the uh, on the video itself. So maybe, yeah, just work. Oh, then again, it's not as big as I thought. <laughs> um. But yeah, look at these columns, looks amazing. But yeah, we're we're way down here. Maybe maybe I could start lighting this up a little bit. Just in case we explore like thoroughly after to try and avoid uh, mob spawning on our face. Yeah, like that just like that and there's creeper uh, <laughs> and this is what I was trying to avoid actually well I can just run and spam some torches well here's where the lava helps a little bit with the light source yeah not so not so big of a cave. I thought it was going to be like a more extensive cave system. Guess not. Just making my way. Making my way downtown. Oh, here we go. Here's where the caves uh, expand a little bit more. But yeah, I, I want to find uh, one of those uh, cities where the warden lives and if I recall well enough the mechanics of the game on that part uh, once the the world generates one of those cities uh, it will generate um, spots of the new blocks the, the ones that spread I'm not so familiar with the name so forgive me if I don't remember how are they called uh, but yeah, I think if you kill, for example, if there's one of those blocks here and you kill one mob, all of the experience points are going into the block and then it will spread the material. And there are blobs of those blocks uh, nearby the cities and you can kind of follow the breadcrumbs um, until you reach the city itself. Uh, so yeah, I, I want to be on the lookout for those. Uh, nothing here. And yeah, I mean, I can still explore this and gather a lot of materials like gold and ma iron that are just like hanging around. And it could be a good uh, resource gathering session for me. But maybe I will do that um, off camera, like in between episodes. And then when we return, then yeah, I'll show you what whatever I found <laughs> and whatever uh, resources I gathered. Which 
normally are quite good now that I have like the fortune 3 um, <coughs> pickaxe so yeah nothing of interest right now I've also heard that uh, in the new uh, update the, the, the 1.20 now that we have archaeology there's supposed to be like new um, like ruins buried ruins uh, where you can find some structures like house like structures that contain a little bit of, of treasure but m mainly they contain the, the new like dirt blocks that are brushable dirt gravel and all that stuff uh, that you can brush and, and find uh, oh like <laughs> oh we have a fight let's see let's see who wins my guess is the right one is going to win just because of the health. Oh, there's a there's a storm. There's a storm going. Maybe I will have to leave just for for me to find uh well to gather more heads. I'm not sure. Rarely do I get to uh, pres uh to to have storms when I'm recording. So yeah, maybe that's a nice opportunity. Wait, what? Are you serious? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, that's such a bummer. That was such a tease. Come on, Minecraft. Are you... Are you... Ah. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess I'll take that as my leave because I already left the caves. So yeah, in between episodes I will keep exploring um, the caves and all of the stuff down there. And yeah, I, th I think uh, in in next episode I'll just give you an update of on how is that going. And maybe we can uh, get back to building some more stuff. Because yeah, we, we are still uh, behind schedule <laughs> in, in regards of building. So yeah, let me just take off my helmet uh, to say goodbye. So yeah. Uh, <laughs> nice exploration adventure for today I really hope you guys enjoyed and if you did please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing and I'll see you in the next episode see ya